Thank you, Superintendent, Director, and distinguished members of the board for allowing me to speak tonight. Um, I'm here to tell you about how saddened I was on the afternoon that I was released from my teaching position. I thought about my students coming in to school on Monday. From the whitest of white with the bluest of eyes to the blackest of black and the brownest of eyes with varying ability levels. They come to me with a sparkle in their eye and a spring in their step. No matter who would greet them on Monday morning for Mystery Book Monday when the students arrive with a sparkle in their eye and a spring in their step to help unwrap a new book that was colorfully wrapped with an awesome bow. We read the, we read the book together and the children are given the time to talk about how that book relates to them. Who would be there on Towel Tuesday when the students arrive with a sparkle in their eye and a spring in their step to choose a colorful towel to sit on while they participate in social skills class? Who would be there on Wall Wednesday when the students would come to my class with a sparkle in their eye and a spring in their step and everything they shared with me positive about the day, I would, I would respond with, wow, that's wonderful. Who would be there on Thursday, Thursday, when they were provided the drink box for their reading class? Because reading makes you thirsty. Who would be there on Friday, fun day, when the students are given time to celebrate all the work that they've done all week long? Still in the box, is the large white plastic tablecloth, the silver duct tape, and the black and white paper plates for our indoor skating event. Ms. Mel, thank you very much. We did receive your materials earlier, and we did. So thank you. 